It's been three months since the incident at Tyler's. About two months ago, I contacted an officer to discuss what I had witnessed. Today is the day we meet. I had received permission to film as long as I don't show the officer's face. What's the microphone for? Well, in April of last year, my uncle slash cousin Christopher William was involved in a drive-by on the south side. Uh, the security camera showed a blue Plymouth Duster coming down the road, and a rifle pops up out. Seven shots were fired in total, two in his head, five in his chest. His Duster can confirm that. I already knew you'd ask that. Um, so here's my family tree. Um, my paternal grandfather had a kid with my maternal aunt. And that's how I have a cousin slash uncle. But in August of last year, I heard on Facebook that Tyler was involved in his death. He was mocking him on Facebook and we met up, fought, and got arrested back in August. No charges were pressed, and four months later I found his apartment. Uh, I don't know much, but he did know a few coke dealers. His girlfriend had a brother that dealt it but he's been in prison since 2012 and was sentenced to 20 years. I came here because of this. This notebook contains a log of his numerous victims that might be connected. It shows drawings of where his victims' bodies might have been dumped. And and this folder contains numerous, numerous photos of his possible victims, similar to what, kind of what Dahmer did. I'll just give you this entire folder, because there's a lot. that also I forgot um, uh, there was ten thousand dollars in one hundred dollar bills numerous coke bags and two bodies in a closet. They must have been pretty fresh because there was very little decomposition on them, um, but their faces were a little deformed gunshots. Um, after I lifted up their hoods I could see their faces. Um, I was able to recognize their faces by this flyer. Um, their identities was Jebediah and Jennifer Jenner. They were last seen December 24th. Um, around the date of when I found their bodies in the closet. So, pretty much kind of confirms that Tyler killed them. Uh, it 
was Thank you for letting me come in. Uh, I've been waiting to do this for a while. Uh, I've been needing to do this. It's this experience pretty pretty traumatized me. Um, I'm just hoping he gets caught and gets what he deserves. So it's currently the next day. I was only expecting Officer Matthew to be there, but there was two other guards next to him. They they never talked, but they were kind of just, I guess, watching over in case if judge or something needed to confirm that I said it, they could be witnesses. I don't know, but I was kind of nervous, which uh, kind of why I was talking the way I was and. I was constantly looking around, kind of like at the other guards, and there were some TVs also there showing security camera footage and stuff like that. Um, but they promised that I'd be safe. They took the papers that I had for evidence, um, and they said there'll be an investigation soon, and that a warrant will happen to where they will search everything in his apartment.